Oh god. Uh, I had to pause it because there was a zombie, or is a zombie right here? Okay. Alright. So my stress level has gone down. Uh, come over here to this desk. Unlock it. I will use the small key. And it frees up an inventory space for me. See? Yay, more rounds. And because I already have some, it just adds on to that. Okay, now we can go back to the other room that we were just at. My last video. Um, I think there's actually some here right here. Um, is this it? Oh my god, thank you! Green herb. Okay, but I'm still in kind of fine caution mode, so... I'm gonna go back here and just... Wait, is this one right here? Okay, no. I thought there was one right there. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> uh, I'm just gonna... Use this so I know that my health is... 100% fine. Okay. I think there's a zombie back here. Yes, there is. And this book, this blue book here, isn't anything special. It's just some kind of log or something like that. Just another useless writing text or something that doesn't really pertain to anything in the game. No, I do not want to check the shotgun. I want you to combine the shotgun with the shotgun shells. Oh, by the way, a friend asked me. A friend asked me um if you can reload the shells when it's not empty. Can you reload it without going to the pause menu, without combining it? No, you cannot. It will not let you only in Resident Evil 4 and 5. Okay, hit this button. And it just shows a lamp. And there's like a faint spot where it wants you to, uh... Where it kind of wants you to push this thing. Yeah, push this statue. That bookshelf behind me will open up like such. And we get the Mo Disc, which will have a purpose later on in the game, but not right now. So we're just gonna grab it and store it away later once we get into a save room. Okay. Um, I think this, this is where the elevator is. Is it? Yes, this is where the elevator was. I forgot. How silly of me. Hither through this door. And now we have to go back to that same spot that I said we were gonna go before, but I didn't because I was in such a bad condition that I would have died if I did. But now we can. So there's really no problem. Uh, come to this door. We gotta go back to Rebecca. I still told her, yeah, this is a, this is like a disadvantage for picking no, or like saying no to her being with you, 
like to come with you in the first part in the first part of the game. Um, if you say no, she stays here, which also means that she gets attacked by this hunter, and we have to save her ass. Oh my god, he's raping her. Rebecca! And now uh, we're just gonna... Good job, Rebecca. Look at me. Now the hunter's gonna go after me. Okay, he's dead. You can choose to talk to Be Rebecca if you want to. But I guess I guess I will. Just, you know, for Rebecca. no reason. Rebecca! Yeah, she's Chris! fine. Chris! Thank God you're safe! I'm sorry that you were worried about me. I wasn't we are in you. great danger. We must organize a search for the others and get the hell out of here. Understood? Yes, sir. Okay, I'll go first. Proceed with your own judgment. All right, can you do it? Yes, I can. Good luck. Okay, now that Chris is done talking to Rebecca like she's a five-year-old, we're gonna go into this save room, so I can drop a couple items off. Okay, um, put the modisk away, you do not need that. And trade it for the ink ribbon, because I need to save. Okay. Mm-hmm, I will. ink ribbon until I get to another typewriter. One that I haven't gone to yet. <laughs> the only reason that, like, if you do talk to her, she just disappears. Like, if you don't talk to her, she'll stay in that corner until you talk to her, but it won't really affect the story in any way. Okay, um... Wait. Oh god! I completely forgot about that hunter over there. Ow! Okay, come in here. I have used the mansion key, and we do not lo- We no- Blah. We no longer need it. <laughs> I swear, I talk like- I'm talking like crap today. Okay. Over here are a couple of items. Which I recommend that you grab. Magnum rounds and some shotgun shells. <laughs> Shotguns are very useful. Thank you. Okay. Um, push this thing. Push this little, s like, stair thing. Alright. It's a deer. Nothing important. So he says. But come over here and turn the light off. And look. <gasps> it's its eye. I will try to take the eyeball out. See, that's very important. And this is the red jewel. Which is where we put the... Where we put this in the same place where we put the blue jewel in. Really? Another one? Ah, uh, he can't hurt me. Oh god, now he can. Wow, that was... Those, those bastards are really quick. Okay, um, if you happen to stumble upon another small key, this door that we unlocked earlier has a desk that can unlock some shotgun shells if anybody was interested in knowing. Because there are several locked desks in this. Oh, we gotta go in here. There are several locked desks in here that contain ammo. 
I just happened to only open two of, or one of them. Okay, we can insert the red eye. And on the other side is... Da 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 da! Look! The Magnum! I called Python to be exact, but yeah, we have it. Okay, let's get out of here. Now that we have the Magnum, we are better armed, so we will definitely live longer. question. Oh god, why did I do that? We gotta go back. Damn it. We have to go back and get the battery because we for- er, I forgot to get the battery because I had low inventory or I didn't have any inventory space. And we need that battery. That is a necessity in this game. door. battery and like it says we can unlock or we can now use the elevator in the court room or courtyard room <laughs> the courtyard where I was getting mauled by those dogs that I just oh so love so much <laughs> 